Hello everyone! This is the first video of the practical XGBoost in Python online course. In this lecture we are going to make sure that everything is working correctly before we proceed further. So, begin with opening your terminal window and downloading all the required code from the GitHub. Once it is done, enter the directory. Before running the container, let's verify that Docker and Docker Compose are properly installed on your system. You can do it by typing docker v and docker compose v. Both commands should have output the actual version of the Docker installed on your machine. If everything looks okay, proceed with running the environment by typing docker compose up. After a few seconds you should have see uh, that the docker have started on the port 8888. Open your favorite web browser and navigate to that page. Local host 8888. You can see that something is running. We can see some basic directories here. Open the first one, introduction, and the corresponding Jupyter notebook. Okay, if you are seeing this screen, it means that you have successfully run a Jupyter notebook. As you can see, it consists of two cells, text cell and code cell. There are two ways of running code cells. You can select it and press Control Enter, or you can run all code cells in the documents automatically by selecting cell from the toolbar and clicking on run all option. But let's do it manually. For example, let's verify which Python version is installed in the container. Let's select the first code cell and press Ctrl Enter. OK, here's the answer. And let's check the NumPy, scikit-learn and XGBoost version. Ctrl Enter. Control enter and control enter. As you can see, we are running the latest version of the libraries. It's okay, so we can proceed with the next lesson.